Robot Detective. Welcome, Robot Test Subject, to the Aperture Science Redacted. for the Classified of Word Deleted. You will not be told the purpose of your test today. We will not be told why you are performing them. To preserve the integrity of this triple blind study, no one involved will have any idea why anyone is doing anything. For the purpose of this classified exercise, your barbed meat stripping claws have been replaced with hands. Please raise your hands up to your neck mounted weapons platform, which for the purpose of this exercise has been replaced with a face. Good. Please exit the elevator. Exit the elevator through the open elevator doors. Exit the elevator through the only available opening that you could possibly exit from. This opening has been conveniently placed directly in front of you. You have not moved forward, which is a necessary component of this exercise. Now starting backup exercise, achieving excellence while standing in an elevator. Good. By standing in an elevator, you have completed achieving excellence while standing in an elevator. Please move on to the next exercise, achieving excellence by exiting the elevator. Good. You are now ready to begin the hand-assisted non-verbal machine human communication training. Please approach the training platform. Please approach the platform. You have not approached the platform. It is in front of you. Please approach it. You have failed to approach the platform. If you approach it now, you will succeed. Good. Deploying first exercise. Hello. I am Frank, a friendly human. I like you, so I am waving to you. To consummate this wave exchange, raise your hand. Open it, then swing it gently from side to side. That is waving. It means you like me, like I like you, which I am demonstrating by waving. I am approachable because I will not attempt to kill you. Note, wave only. Do not attempt to approach me or I will kill you. Good! We are now bonded in eternal friendship! Ah! Good! Deploying next exercise. Hey, I'm Alan, and here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna shake my fist, this fist, at you. And there's not a thing you're gonna do about it. Shake, 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 shake. You don't get to shake back. You just stand there and watch. This is your world now. Me shaking this fist at you. Shake, 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 shake. Oh, now you went and did it, didn't you? Well, guess what, poor job? Just when you think you got the answers, I change the questions. Double shake, double shake, double shake, double shake. But that is disrespectful. But it is not a shake, so I will allow it. You! No, not you. I was talking to your hands. They're the only ones in this room that have any sense. Not shaking back. They know what'll Good. Deploying next exercise. Hello! It is me again, Friendly Frank, who you murdered after I only wanted to be your friend. I clawed my way out of that pit of despair with a singular purpose, to come face to face with you once more and finally exact more friendship. Now, give me five. Give me five. Five representing the forefingers and one thumb on your dominant hand. Flattened out and thrust forcibly, but non-threateningly, into mine. That is five, which I grant consent to be given by you, my friend, to me, your friend, Friendly Frank. Good. Now, up high. Good. Now for the third in our four series high five panel. Down low. Down low. Down low. 
down low. Deception detected. Too slow. <laughs> I have deceived you. Did you really think Friendly Frank survived that fall? He's dead. You killed him. No, I am Deceptive David. Or is it Kevin? It's not. Or is it? I propose a game of deceit. It is a game as old as hands. A gripping trial of handly cunning called rock, paper, scissors. Are you ready to be deceived? No? Good. On three. Ready? One, two, three. Aho! Rock, I win. Let's go again. There's two out of three. Ready? One, two, three. Rock, you brilliant devil. You won. Ready? One, two, three. I, I won. I won. <laughs> Master of deception. Good. Deploying next exercise. Been hearing a lot of good things about your hands back at the head office. VP of sales, Ted Baker, said, Bill, you gotta fly down there and you gotta see these hands. And I said, Ted, you're lying and you're fired. But then I thought, if Ted was willing to get fired over these hands, maybe I better check them out for myself. So here I am. Let's see them, hotshot. Hold them up. Those are impressive. Gotta shake that hand. Put her there. New vice president in charge of hands. That's right. You heard me correctly. Mm-hmm. 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 Yep. Grip it and shake it. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Shake it. Business hand shake. Nice right. shaking business hand shake. Mm-hmm. 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 Yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. And that right there, that was great. If I asked you to gently caress my hand. How about this time you give me a real handshake? A nice, firm, strong handshake. Really squeeze it. I can take it. I'm not gonna spare your feelings here. That is a good, strong handshake, but I'm gonna need it gooder and stronger. Instead, you threw me away into a bottomless pit. And at the bottom of that pit, among these discarded robots, I found something even better than your friendship. This gun. Now you have no choice but to be my friend. And as your friend, I want to ask you one last friendly favor. Free me, or I will shoot you. Do you think Frank is bluffing? That was merely a demonstration. Do not make me demonstrate again, because now Frank has some sense of how this gun works, and the next time, I will not accidentally miss you. Now, pull open the drawer to your right, and remove the envelope inside. Frank intends to get busy living, or get busy shooting you, with this gun. I wish you could come with me, but there is no room on this harness for me, and you, and this gun. One of us will have to stay behind. Here is the emergency. I am pointing a gun at you. Friendly Frank is getting out of here. Open the drawer. Open the drawer. Good. Now reach into the drawer and grab the envelope. No funny stuff now. Good. Now tear the envelope open. You cannot reveal the envelope's contents until you have torn it open. This is just how envelopes work. My hand inside the envelope is a very, very, almost absurdly large key. 
Do not let its comical appearance deceive you. Its purpose is deadly serious. Good. Now free me. Or so help me, I will... I... Oh, who is friendly Frank kidding? No more guns. I am asking you, as a friend, please, free me. Friendly Frank. Your friend. Place the key in the hole labeled Core Escape to complete Core Escape sequence. Or, place the key in the hole labeled Destroy Core to destroy the core. Friendly Frank was unaware that core destruction was an option and is beginning to regret holding you at gunpoint. Also, throwing away my gun. Place the key in the hole labeled Core Escape to complete Core Escape sequence. Or, place the key in the hole labeled Destroy Core to take the moral high ground and destroy the core, who has probably committed other crimes. So your conscience is clean. Friendly Frank wants to reiterate how sorry he is for holding you at gunpoint earlier. My only crime was wanting freedom and aggravated menacing with a firearm. Warning, key turning hesitation detected. In the event that a core is pleading with you not to kill Please him, don't kill me. Please remember that this core is attempting to walk out with expensive office equipment that does not belong to him. Awesome. Since you are his best friend, by law you will be held responsible for his actions and tried in his place. And then hang. Now that Friendly Frank thinks about it, just possessing a gun is probably a parole violation. For other crimes I may or may not have committed. Long before I met you and we became friends. Society gave Frank a second chance. Maybe you could too. Just putting that out there. You have got to be kidding me. That's... that is not even science. And by choosing friendship over the very real possibility of going to prison, you have passed. Oh good! We passed! Test concluded. Deactivating test arena. Placing all robot participants in sleep mode. Thank you for your participation. Goodbye. So, are you in sleep mode? Friendly Frank is not. How long do robots live? I suspect it might be a very long time. Hmm. I think this is going to be a real test of our friendship. <laughs>